Crocus Mia. And I found that they do really well in the sunlight. Mm-hmm. So... We're going to plant them amongst the, uh, wow, that daily leaf got the big... There, what it looked like before we did it. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. I'll go ahead and put a couple more in here. So a tiny little gap. A tiny little gap. They're just me, are these like much darker when they're um, over there than here? Yeah, maybe. Oh, so I thought you had some day flowers here, right? Yeah, they're daily. Like, they're daily. Okay. Uh, I can tell because they um, crocus me are very flat leafed, and the daylily have this kind of like curved. The base leaf. Uh, uh, yeah, they're, they uh, produce these little tiny iris blooms, kind of like this. Carefully, because a lot of more impressive than watching. Our yard and part of it's their yard, so oh, you have to yeah. make it so that they don't feel threatened by it. These might not do so great with the I can tell I put a day flower right there. Yeah. It's empty stuff. Are you gonna dig up this um carpet bugle to plant it in? Mm. Okay. There'll be a small gap in the train. It looks really pretty though when you align them with the uh like a like a very thin wall so they look like I quite like that look. Especially when they bloom. Well I don't know if the um daily are ever gonna bloom. Oh yeah they do, they bloom really well here. Here, really? Yeah. Because they get really well sun. Ah, of course, yes. Do you plant that in there as well? Do you plant this piece of uh, cover? No. no? Okay. I really wish the bulbs were edible. They look huh? like they look like little nuts. Help. Yeah. These nuts or something. Unfortunately, I can't get these very deep in there, so I don't know. Hmm. Well, they'll grow, grow deeper eventually, right? Yeah. Do you have some sort of pattern going on here? Or just... Do we have a date for our kids in here? Let's go. looks out of place. Oh, that's a big one, though. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's see. Oh, yeah.
more day flower right there. Well, it wasn't a, quite far apart as that one. But um, this one right here, which is kind of big. Uh, that one right there. But that one's still kind of part of that, I guess. There's this big one. Yeah, here. I think it's kind of big. I don't know. Is it? I find it interesting that this purple plant right here is growing here. This? That is the purple plant, isn't it? The one yeah. Is it the one with spikes? Yeah. Why doesn't it have any spikes on it yet? No, it, it isn't the same one. Okay, well. Is it? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it is. The leaf looks exactly the same. Nice. Okay, let me get one of these purple ones. It looks different. Does that single plant have two bulbs? What? What? Ow. Remarkably, daylilies and crocus mia are both closer to um, asparagus than tree lilies. Closer to asparagus than tree lilies. They're not actually lilies. They're in the asparagus family. I think um, crocus mia was an iris. I think. I feel like that opens up too much of a hole. Huh? Right there. What? I feel like that opens up too much of a hole right there. No. Why do you pull out some of these? I guess these are crocus mia though, aren't they? Yep. So there is. All the way down. Easier said than done.
Mine. I planted it in there. It is, isn't it? Yep. What is that? Is that a crinum? It's a crinum, isn't it? Oh. Do wait till my hands are out of the way. Sorry. I know your aim's good, but seriously. Huh? I know your aim is good, but seriously. Yeah, yeah you're right. Bring these two back in there. Obviously that kind of would not be well there. Watch your fingers. Clean your toes. Oh, it's a very edge, huh? What do you... Is that it? Yeah, awesome. Bunch of um. I need a water. Cricket's being empty. Plus, I said, yeah.